How are we doing guys? So happy Friday. So I've actually spent the week reaching out to members and um, just to see how they're getting on and some of them are struggling which is no surprise considering the times that we're in and the word that has come up so much is my nemesis which is motivation <laughs> okay i'm gonna make this personal all right i am not a highly motivated individual not at all i do not get up at 5.30 in the morning and drink a fucking green smoothie with kale and spinach and cabbage water. I don't then go and take a cold shower for 30 minutes. I don't get up and breathe and do a morning ritual. I don't. Alright. I get up at a normal hour like everybody else. And yet, our, my business, our business is successful and thankfully our online business is very successful. And the reason for this is because I like to keep things simple, all right? And I like to make sure that I don't have to rely on motivation. And what I do is just have little systems in place that make it unnecessary for me to be always motivated, which to be honest, I rarely am. So the first thing I do, and this I'm gonna try and relate this back to fitness as much as possible. So the first thing I do is I choose my focus areas. Three things every day. And for lockdown, I do the exact same thing, exact same three things every day. So for me, it's get up, serve my, serve my members. That's number one priority. Members look after them, make sure that they're all feeling good and getting through this lockdown. Number two is um, memberships, try to bring in new memberships to keep the business going. You have to be bringing in front end income. So that's number two. And number three is try and do a little bit of content here and there. So just try to keep your, stay present on the all the different platforms. So that's it, three things every day and just forget about everything else. Just get, let go of all the distractions. And how you can relate this back to fitness is just pick three things every day. For yourself to focus on so you could maybe i'm going to do a home workout i'm going to walk ten thousand steps and i'm going to try and divide processed food that's just an example that's three things you could pick every single day and focus on those three things and make those and make them your three focus areas number two it's very important to remember jesus lads i got i butchered my hair anyway it's very important to remember that motivation is optional all right you do not need to feel motivated to do things you just don't once you get into the habit of doing things you just do them anyway rarely do i feel i didn't feel like doing this video right now yet i'm halfway in um i've often done workouts and nine times out of ten i don't really feel like doing them but i get and i do them anyway and when you start doing them when you start to do the thing it helps you to do the thing. So it's just about getting started, stop procrastinating and getting stuck in. And it's the exact same thing with your fitness. Rarely are you gonna feel like starting, rarely are you gonna feel like um, getting in and doing a workout. But once you start, once you get into the workout and once the endorphins start to flow, you keep going, all right? And then it's about repetition, repetition, repetition. It just becomes an ingrained habit and it's just something you do. So for me, luckily, exercise is just something I do. No matter how well I slept, how poorly I slept, how I'm feeling, how up or down I am, exercise is just an ingrained habit. So, and that's because repetition, repetition, repetition. And it can be the exact same for your fitness. Once you do it, do it, do it, do it. It just becomes one of those things you do. Number three is delegate where possible. Now I'm very fortunate in business to have a fantastic gym manager and fantastic staff. So I can delegate out a lot of tasks. How does this relate to your fitness? You should delegate your fitness, all right? You should hire a coach. You could hire a fantastic gym that does fantastic online classes. You could, so you're delegating out your fitness. Instead of you having to look up what to do, what to eat, the person you delegate out to, should be a fit fitness, will do that for you. So it'll take all the thinking away from you 
and help you to just focus on just getting fit. You don't need to go studying. You don't need to wonder if you're doing the right thing or the wrong thing. You just do as the person you delegate out to, which should be Fitz Fitness. Just do as they say. All right. So you're delegating out. Personally, I have a business coach. I have a fitness coach. I have a great gym manager. So I delegate out. And what that allows me to do is focus on my three main focus areas. All right. And finally, this isn't part of the tree, but enjoy the feckin' ride. All right. So if you are going on a fitness journey, don't get so caught up with the end result. All right. Don't forget to enjoy the process of getting fit. And don't forget to acknowledge how well you're feeling, how much more energy you have, how much more sleep you're getting. They're all real markers of progress. Too many times we get caught up with the end number or the numbers looking up at us on a little box on the floor. It's not what it's all about. You have to go and enjoy the journey, enjoy the workouts, enjoy how you feel. And if you wanna have loads of fun and you wanna have, it's exactly what we do for our um, online program and engine program, but at the moment, online program, we simplify it. We keep it simple. We give you focus areas every single day. We don't overwhelm you and we make the whole thing enjoyable. All right, so if you'd like to know more, please, 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 get in touch but please do me one favor motivation <laughs> all right you don't need it you don't need it in your life don't rely upon it it's never going to be there it's never going to show up when you need it as i said before it's like that friend it's always there when times are good it's fecking nowhere to be seen when times are bad so motivation is definitely not your friend all right talk to you soon guys um i hope this little video um was good. Talk to you soon, guys.